This is the new Digifort mobile client developed with Delphi XE5 and FireMonkey. You can see now how smooth the app runs on this Samsung Galaxy S4. The app was developed using a drawer layout, so you can slide to the left or to the right revealing the tools and the options. Let's now connect to Digifort server by tapping on it. Once the connection is established, we can now view the live cameras. By sliding up or down, you can view the next or previous cameras. On the left hand side, you will find the cameras and events list. Notice how smooth the list moves, and it was all developed using common FireMonkey controls. To view a camera, just tap on it, and it will be the first camera to be displayed on screen. Near each camera and event, you see a star icon. That icon is used to build your favorites list. All you have to do is tap in the star and it will be selected, meaning that the object is now in the favorites list. The favorites list can be easily sorted by dragging and dropping items using its icon. Digifort Mobile Client allows you to select the streaming parameters such as frame rate, quality and resolution. Those parameters will affect the quality of the images and the required bandwidth. The resolution can be configured to values as high as 1080p. As you can see, you can view multiple cameras with Digifort Mobile Client, and you can configure the layout that you want to view those cameras when the device is on portrait or landscape position. For portrait position, you can view two or three cameras simultaneously. For landscape position, you can view four or nine cameras simultaneously. Digifort Mobile Client allows you to use alarms and events from Digifort system. Those events can be integrated to external physical devices, such as a gate. See how easy I open and close this gate remotely by using this cell phone. You can easily control PZ cameras with Digifort mobile clients. This is the standard PZ control and you can see that it is a very light overlay and it blends very well with the image. And once you start using it, the borders will show up and the whole PZ control will be revealed. As you can see, I, I can pan the camera to the right, to the left. I can zoom in, zoom out, all controls 
that you expect from uh, a PC camera. Here on the left hand side we can control the power of the, the PC of the control so see how, how the camera moves very slowly and now very fast and by tapping on this little icon we have the presets just select the preset that you want and the camera will move to it We have two types of PZ control, the standard PZ control and the joystick PZ control. With the joystick you can control the camera continuously. And like the standard control, the joystick control will be closed by default and when you click on it, it will open and allows you to control the camera. And on the left hand side we have the zoom control that you can zoom in and zoom out. And just to mention again, everything was developed with FireMonkey. We did not use an, any external control or any third-party library. We just used the standard controls provided by the Fi FireMonkey framework, such as images, shapes, buttons. One thing that is very powerful to make nice-looking interfaces is the animation engine, such as Float Animation, and we use it everywhere to move things, to make transitions and fade effects. You can share the image that you are viewing by tapping this icon. The share dialog will open and will allow you to select between many sharing options, such as sending the image by email. Digifort Mobile Client allows you to use the virtual matrix from Digifort system. With the virtual matrix, you can send images to any monitor from your surveillance system. To do that from the mobile device, all you have to do is selecting a camera in full screen. Then you do a long tap until the monitor list appears. And when the monitor list is available, just select the monitor you wish to send the image and slide it up and the camera that you are viewing will be now displayed in the selected monitor. Just see it one more time how easy it is to use the virtual matrix from Digifort. Digifort Mobile Camera, an app capable of turning your mobile device into a remote camera, allowing you to send live videos from your device to your Digifort server. See how easy it is to stream live video from this device. You can use Digifort Mobile Client to view the video that's being sent from another device such as this iPhone. As you can see, we are now streaming video from the iPhone to Digifort server and viewing it live from this Android phone. And we can even use the virtual matrix function from mobile clients to send this video feed directly to a remote monitor. See how easy it is.
you can even use Ditfort Mobile Client to view images from Ditfort Insight. Ditfort Insight is a screen capture software for Windows desktop systems that is capable of sending a live screencast from the desktop it is installed to a Ditfort server, allowing its remote visualization and remote control. And with Mobile Client, you will be able to view the screen from any Windows desktop PC directly from your mobile device. Thank you.